Hi all, welcome back to new video. So let's discuss about how to manage the tax system in Odoo Accounting module. Odoo allows the business to manage their taxes, that is the price of taxes included or excluded in a business. There is two approach that is tax included and tax excluded. Tax included is the approach that is used in retail shops as well as the business that is directly facing customers. In this case, the amount of tax will be added with the sales price and it will be shown as the final price of the product. So the customer only need to pay for the final price during the checkout of the product. In case of tax excluded, uh, this approach is used in business to business. Here, uh, the business will be the registered customer and they can claim for the amount of tax that they need to pay for. So this will allow the business to make more flexible and will provide the transparency and that shows a business what is the exact amount that to be paid uh, for an organization as well as the amount that to be paid so let's check how to manage tax included and excluded of a product or services in odoo in order to set the tax included and tax excluded of accounting module just go to the configuration settings and search for customer invoices so under customer invoices you can see you can see tax included and tax excluded let's choose the first option that is tax excluded and save the changes in the settings and now we can also set a tax for the product so for that just go to the customers uh, menu and you can choose a product or you can create a product so let me choose a product as cabinet with chairs sorry cabinet with doors and you can set the customer taxes with the tax speed of uh, 15 percentage now save the changes now you can uh, either create a vendor bill or a customer invoice let's choose the invoice and let's create a new invoice for that you have to choose a customer let like the customer pay the credit and you can choose the product that is cabinet with top so as you choose a uh, cabinet with doors here you can see that the price is 140 and the subtotal is also 140 and the tax is not included in the invoice lines uh, and the tax is only calculated in the total amount of the product uh, under the uh, I mean in the uh, invoice uh, form and you can click on confirm and click on register payment and you can create the payment so that after reconciliation the payments will be moved to the back now just go to the configuration settings and you can search for customer invoice and choose the option that is tax included and save the changes now let's create a new invoice with the same product click on new and let's choose the customer as azure interior and choose the same product that is cabinet with door so as you select uh, the product in the invoice lines you can see that the price of the product is 140 but the subtotal is 161 okay so in case of tax included it will be calculated as the sum of sales price plus the taxes so this is how Odoo managed the tax included and tax excluded now click on confirm button so that you can make the payment by clicking register payment so click create payment so that after reconciliation the payment will be moving to the back okay so hope uh, the concept of uh, managing the tax included and tax excluded is clear for you in short we can say that tax included and tax excluded makes the business more flexible and provide transparency in the business so hope this concept is clear for you thank you for watching the video